place for you. Do you remember uh, that experience? I do. Um, obviously, it's the third time in charm because I was great. I would play by Coach Stone and then uh, by Bobby Kelsey. And then so when I got the opportunity when graduating from Bandy, Wisconsin, it's always been like a part of my heart, obviously, because my mom grew up here, I a family up here. Uh, and this was probably like my second take of option, like coming out of high school. So when I got that opportunity again, I was like, you, I can't pass it up, and I love what Coach Sip is doing with the program, so it's like the perfect place for me to come at this point in my life. Uh, uh, Fox Lake. Oh, well, we have a house at Fox Lake, but she is from like the Juno area. Okay. Yeah. yeah. It was that recruiting time. It was a lot of things happened. We're going on here. It was crazy. Right? Yeah. I mean, it's a crazy thing for anyone to go Right. Did that? Remember how close you came here, or did Dobby followed up with you? After? Yeah. Um, so honestly, like when I was when Coach Stone, I came on my visit here, and she was like, "All right, Kendall, like, what do you think?" I honestly almost like committed on the spot because I've always loved the program, and then obviously like a bunch of things happened, and then so Bobby reached out to me and was like, "Kendall, like, we would like to honor your scholarship." Um, so I came on a visit with her and did like met her whole coaching staff and stuff like that. Um, and then when it just came down to, and then so obviously that didn't I didn't pick, but um, when I got this opportunity, obviously I, I couldn't pass it up because everything Coach Zip has like when I came on my visit, he was just like, "Kind of like this, this, and this is what I want to do." I was like, "That sounds perfect for me. Like I would love to like help rebuild this program with my with the staff and the team." So. I just love that. So your Vandy years, mm -hmm. a couple injuries, you missed it. Like, I missed almost. two seasons, yeah. How um, were they? I had a left ACL and a right foot surgery. Mm -hmm. And so you, you actually played here, though. I did. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Any, uh, was that, how was that experience? It was an amazing experience. I've always loved, like, the fans here. Like, they're so supportive and just the atmosphere at the Cole Center. So it was obviously a little weird being black and gold, but um, I'm really excited to step on there in red and white. So I'm excited for the first game. Aside from the injuries, what did four years of Vandy do yeah, for you? Yeah, four years. What did you gain from that? Um, I just gained a lot of experience, obviously. Um, I mean, being able to be in the NCAA tournament two years was an amazing opportunity, and coming out with that education and um, good teammates I had there, like all that. I mean, I wouldn't trade for the world, obviously, because it's made me who I am. Um, it's made me a strong person. Really, so. It's not all uh, sunshine and roses. <laughs> there, I mean, there, the program went through. Yeah, so it's been through some that, of Kind of as a real life learning experience yeah, versus everything going yeah through. right you definitely you definitely learn from a bunch of guys Ryan how you doing I'm still good developing really hard questions at any point when you were uh, <laughs> four years were up were you saying well I'm done I've been beat up you know I didn't find where you are or no I don't think that always basketball has always been like I never thought like, well Kendall you have four years like you're like even though you have that extra eligibility, like you don't have to choose it. You know, like I honestly like was like, all right, like I want to keep playing. So I thought it would be best to keep playing and come here. How the connection, the reconnection happens? Um, <laughs> yeah, I do. Uh, well, so like I asked for my release or whatever. And at that point, they didn't have a coach here yet, so I was like, all right, like I don't know what to do because I would love to come up here. Um, and then I heard Coach Sip got the job, and I had an uh, old teammate that played for him at GW, and she was like, I love Coach Sip, blah, 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 blah. I was like, awesome. I was like, I really would like to play for him. Um, and so I was also talking with Brandon Clay of Peach State um, and some other people, and they put me in contact with Coach Sip along with my dad. Um, and we were just we called him up and we were like, hey, like, do you guys need like an extra post player? Like, I'm looking yeah, to transfer like these knowledge really elsewhere. And then so we just talked on the phone and I came on my visit like three days before graduating college. 
and committed like an hour after leaving. <laughs> I was just like, Hope's I'm ready to be a Badger. A third time's the charm. Thank you.